Hello everyone, Michael here playing Paper Mario for the Nintendo 64. As it turns out, there are trees in this area that drop berries, and that's what we're supposed to do. I, I kind of missed out on that on the previous video, so we're going to go back over here and find the tree which drops berries, because you absolutely 100% have to do that in order to continue through the flower fields. Our overall goal through the flower fields is to, is to grow a magic beanstalk, and for that we have to find a bunch of different items. Like, we found the magic bean, that's good. We also need fertilizer and water, so we have to find those things too. But, um, you know, more pressingly, we need to find those magic berries, which are going to be right over here. Just hit this tree. Well, let me hit the tree from this side. There we go! We got a red berry! Hooray! 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 So that will let us get past the red flower guardian. And if, if you try to visit the various areas, you'll, you'll notice we have a bunch of flower guardians everywhere. Like, uh, this area has a yellow flower guardian. This area in the bottom... Would I say this is the bottom left, or would I say it's the upper left? I'd say it's more like the upper left. This has a... A bubbleberry. Okay, bubbleberry guardian. Where's the red one? Oh, is this the blue one? Do I have the blueberry? Yeah, this this wants... No, I've got a red berry. Okay. So that's blueberry. So where's red berry? It's gotta be the final place. Hey, superstar! Uh, you get yourself a gift if you hit the trees. Left, right, middle. <laughs> yeah. Well, you know something good? If you find the well, you can throw something in it, like a blueberry! <laughs> hmm. Maybe we need to get a berry for the well. Blueberry. Okay, I'll have to remember that. And this is the red flower guardian. Fantastic. Now we can get past because we have the red berry. And it's delicious. Full flavor. Great color. Just a perfect, all-around perfect berry. Cool. So, let's, let's switch to Goombario here. We've got a new enemy I want to show off. Ow! That did not work well. So this is the rough puff. Have Goombario kill the zap. And then I'll have Goombario tattle the rough puff on the next turn. This is a rough puff. Cloud henchman. So 10 HP. Yeah, lots of HP. I, I don't know about that. Kind of rough. I imagine these enemies would be, like, almost impossible if I didn't have badges increasing my attack power. Ow. Tried to jump on the rough puff there. It did not work. Okay, let's kill the rough puff. Oh, I wish there's a way to dodge that attack. I guess the timing for that attack uh, is just just ridiculously difficult because it's, it's a fast attack. Go! No! Okay. So maybe right before it flips is when I'm supposed to uh, do the attack. Or, or do the dodge. Anyway, Mario's almost... Who's dying here? I should get him filled up to higher HP. What was that? Did I knock down the vines? Oh! You can knock down the vines! Okay. Yellow berry! Nice! Okay, yellow berry. This looks like some watery place. 
Look at the crystal tree. It's beautiful. I'm posy. This is not my mouth. This is my nose. And it's got fertile soil. Your nose is pretty nice, too. Here, take the fertile soil. Great, so we've got fertile soil. Yeah, so we've got most of our ingredients. And I got the yellow berry, so I can continue through the yellow area. Woohoo! Yay! Jumping! Hooray! Can I drop the fertile soil here already? Nope. Doesn't look like these characters have anything new to say. Lily. Okay. What about you? I haven't gotten any crystal berries. Was I supposed to go crystal berries? Hmm. Sun. Okay, so maybe we have to find water and the sun and fertilizer and the bean in order to build the build our thing. Either way, here, have some yellow berries. Alright, so this is a challenge with Paracarry. Might want to go back on the left-hand side of the block before making Paracarry carry you across. Because that was dangerous right there. He almost dropped me in the middle of the vine pit. Obviously the vine pit is awful and you don't want to be on the vine pit. Please don't drop me. Please don't. Okay. Okay, this gap looks a little bit larger. I think I can make it through this gap safely. I almost fell off though too. Paracarry, be more... Be less crazy. Ooh, another tree. Blueberries. Okay, let's get two blueberries. One one for the blue flower, and then one for the well. Dizzy dial. Yay. This looks like an area we can swim with sushi. Except there's no water, so um, I guess we can't. What is here? It's Lily! This has got to be Lily, right? Water Lily? So she needs the water stone. Handsome Prince? That's me! I'm Mario! Okay, I'm actually a plumber, but hey, I'm fantastic. I'm a beautiful, fragile flower. I need you to get the water stone. And maybe we get the water stone from the well. Because it's blue and stuff. Please find it. Okay, I'll try to help you out, Lily. I'll try to help you out, and I see a tree near you. I'm gonna hit that tree. So this is... Jam and jelly. Oh, let's get rid of the stinky stuff. Keep the jam and jelly. Hello. You know, I'm still not sure why I why I carry so many items around with me when I never use them in battle. It just seems like a waste waste of inventory space. Well, maybe there's maybe there's an item I'm missing which will allow you to use um, lots and lots of items in battle. Oh no! Oh, Crazy Daisy runs away. Okay, well uh, I didn't get any star points, but I won the battle. No, like, I mean, that, that, like, maybe there's an item in this game. Like, if we solve enough of Koopa Koot's, uh, challenges, he will give us the, the super fancy item, which allows us to carry, carry 20 items at a time instead of just 10. I don't know, we'll try that out. I'll make sure to do a video of, uh, of that at some point 
in in time. Jeez. Mm, See, this this is so sad with all these cool items I have to get rid of. No, no, no. What I'm trying to say is, uh, 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 you know, once I finish with this chapter, after you finish with chapter six, Koopa Koot gets new new challenges, new new um, requests that he wants you to do. And that's the last time he comes up with new ones. So he, he gets like two or three of them after every chapter. But once you finish chapter number six, that's, that's the last time he gets new requests for you. New favors. I think favor is the, the exact term. Take a Mario, kill a crazy daisy. Mario wakes up in time to gather the star points. Mario, you lazy bum, just pretending you contributed. So let's have Mario uh, focus here. Now what I should do is, um, you know, put on the focus badges. Don't I have two of them? <laughs> You know, put on the focus badges so so Mario gets more power, star power from focusing. I'll try to avoid that enemy. Did not work, and it's a bunch of crazy daisies. Okay, dizzy dial. Whoa, whoa. Worked on two of them. Two of them are totally okay. Let me try multi bonk here. So that will allow me to uh, just do that attack multiple, multiple times. So it's, it's, it's kind of a helpful attack and also kind of not helpful attack too sometimes. Don't fall asleep, Mario. Hey, I dodged that attack. Good job, Mario. You obviously have to be super good with the... Um, the action commands in order to uh, use multi bonk effectively. And I think it also works like like we saw there, where once once you go down to like one one damage, it the uh, the uh, attack automatically just stops working because otherwise you'd be doing. I mean, you saw it. It did three damage, and then two damage, and then one damage, and then it stops because. 1 minus 1 is 0, so it went down by 1 every single time, and doing 0 damage to the enemy is silly. I think that's the logic behind that. I, I don't know. I don't know, that's my first time using it in this game. <laughs> Who am I upgrading? Let's upgrade. Let's upgrade Paracarry. Not that I ever use Paracarry, except for those crazy flying challenges. Crazy flying challenge. You can do this paracarry. Oh, this means I'll have to do it again to get back to Lily. That's unfortunate. Okay, and here. Okay, not so bad when you're doing it in reverse. So what was I doing? Blueberry. Blueberry in the well. Okay. So let's get blueberry in the well. Okay. Dodging these enemies somewhat effectively. That bee enemy really, really wanted to destroy me. <laughs> yeah. Sniffle, sniffle. Who's throwing stuff down my well? This is a blueberry. I love it. Flower saver badge. Huh. Gee, I wonder, wonder what happens if I throw a different type of berry down the well. 
maybe maybe what happens is that the well doesn't really uh, work until we filled up with water. You're throwing stuff down my well. This is rude. Oh, oh, okay. Well then. Only blueberries down the well. Good to know. So, air raid. Fly around like crazy, attacking all enemies. Uh, that seems interesting. Interesting enough attack, I suppose. So let me switch back to Gulbario, because I like him. Just go all the way back. So I, I've got the blueberry. Let's see if we can find that blue flower. Okay. Oh, dodging that enemy didn't work. I just ran right into it. Fortunately, the enemy is super easy to defeat now. I want to get those coins. Yes! Okay. Got the coins while avoiding the Amazy Daisy. Or Crazy Daisy, or whatever we call that enemy. Okay, blue flowers gotta be here, right? That's bubbled plants. Hmm, I don't have bubbled berry. See, did I go over here? Blue plant, here we go. No, not the jamming jelly! Mario, no! Oh! Oh, that was a great item! Mario! Oh, there goes the item that you could sell for lots of coins. Okay. Yay! Okay, so we got through the blueberries area. And that looks like one of those trees that I can hit. Oh, and that looks like a new enemy. Um, why is there a bouncy thing here? It's a jump pad. Really? Okay, let me use Watt to see if there are any hidden, hidden things. Okay, so there's the jump pad. Ow. That's a dumb move on Mario's part. I'm not sure Watt can actually hurt this enemy. Oh, I can. Good job, Watt. Still, I'm gonna see if I can solve this puzzle on my own. So I jump here. Jump here onto the hidden block. Jump from there to the other hidden block. Get a shooting star. Nice. But I don't really see how this will help me with my quest. In fact, I don't see how this has anything to do with what I'm trying to accomplish here. Ha! Ah, avoided that enemy. This looks like a maze. Hey, where'd you drop it, you idiot? We'll be in trouble if we don't find it. I'm so clumsy. Ah! Ah, they found the stone! Okay, so this is where the water stone is. Look, man, it's Mario! Let's look for the stone later. Let's rough him up. Mario? I don't know. He's really strong. Alright, cloud enemies. Lakitu. So if you've played Mario Brothers games before, you probably know about the Lakitu. They throw those little those enemies that are on the ground. 
pick him up and throw him at you. I remember them from the first Mario Brothers game. <laughs> Super Mario Brothers 1, uh, level, level, world 4, world 4. Kind of tough. It, it, it was like kind of tough for you to, to like get through that level because you're always being chased by that enemy that's throwing stuff at you. Okay, I should use. Didn't I just get a super cool attack that works really well against these enemies? I did. Let's go for it. Probably should have done that sooner. Oh well. Take that, Lakitu. Oh, and this is some sort of crazy maze. Okay. Okay, well, let's see if we can figure this out. Each part of the maze looks like it takes you to another part. Okay. Let's go down this pipe. I imagine we have to go down the pipes. It'd help if I knew where my destination was in the maze. Can I go down here? I can. Perhaps I'm trying to reach um, that random block there. How do I reach it, though, is the question. Do I have to reach it from the right-hand side? Doesn't look like I can breach it from underneath. Oh wait, there's a pipe that looks like it leads to an exit. Perhaps I have to reach this pipe here in order to get through it. You know what would help if the barriers for this maze were a bit more obvious as to uh <laughs> this will go you this will let you in through here. There we go. There we go. Not so bad. Hi, Rose. This must be Rose. Rosie! You are pretty cool, Rosie. I need that water stone! Give it to me, give it to me, give it to me! Lily is in trouble. Oh, come on, you don't want to help Lily? Oh no, flowers are fighting. What can I find that's more beautiful than this flower? A water stone. Maybe it's that crystal, crystal berry thing, which means, I don't know, let's see what Goombario has to say. Mario has nothing interesting to add to the conversation. Okay. So I guess we have to go back to the crystal tree so we can go back to the rose so we can go back to the lily. So much wandering around. And now we have to solve this maze in reverse. I think I can do this. My memory is good enough for this. Yep, there we go. Exit, 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 Mario, exit, there we go. We made it through, hooray. Oh, we got hit by the first strike, not hooray. At least Gumbario can, uh, tattle these enemies. That'll help. Spinies. Lots of defense. Why 
Mario's not doing so well. Might need to go to town and heal Mario when I get the chance. enemies return. Can I just run away now? Yeah, I'm just gonna run away from these enemies. I, I don't I don't want to fight them that badly. I really, really don't. Let's see what this flower has to help. What happened to this thing with the, the three trees? Left, right, middle. Hmm. I don't remember him saying it. I mean, I don't remember them being three trees left, right, middle. Anyway, I'll go back to Toad Town and heal myself. In the next video, I'll continue this quest of going through the flower gardens.